Hello and welcome to Apple's Tutorials. In today's video, I'll show you how to customize or how to modify the single product page of Woodmark theme. So currently you are looking at my single product page which is actually built with Elementor but using Woodmark theme. So I'm using Elementor free for this and there is no Elementor Pro license and still we can create the templates because I already have the Woodmark theme installed and activated. So if you're thinking that this can be edited by going to dashboard and Woodmark and theme settings, then there is a page, a tab called product, single product page here. Then you are right, but not in the case where Woodmark uses Elementor. If you choose Elementor's template, uh, use a site built with Elementor, then this these settings will not work with that. The only setting that will work is the builder, the preview product for builder. And I'll show you how it will look like. So if you want to modify this single product template, then you just have to hover on the edit with Elementor. You have to log in to the WP admin administrative privileges to see this strip. So if you click on edit with Elementor, then in the single product layout here, single product layout, you can click here to open it in Elementor editor. And this is only possible when you are using Woodmark theme and Woodmark is um, installing the demo website using Elementor. Okay, now you can see every element have its own selector and box. So you can change the breadcrumbs, you can change the card settings, the card notification area. If you click here, it's the edit WooCommerce notices. It's the WooCommerce notices or card notification. So this is the edit product title, you can see product title, the product excerpt or short description, here is the product gallery element and all these elements are from Woodmark theme. If you go there, you can see it, there is a whole bunch of section for XTMOs elements. So these are the general elements, these are elements for WooCommerce and these are specific for single products. So here's a single product content, product price, single size guide, product rating, product brand, short description. So this one is this element, the short description one for single product, this one. Okay, uh, rather than going here, um, unless you are creating a new template, you do not need to go there. Just have to click on any element to change it or remove it. So here is the product gallery. Here is the new row and these are the custom elements. You can uh, type text here or you can choose the icon here. You can change the button text or the button link. Okay, these are the elements for shopping uh, for WooCommerce. So this is the price, the product price, and this is the stock status. This is the product coupon, uh, product countdown. And here's the product stock progress bar. It will show how many products are left in your shopping cart. Let me open it on front end. So you can see the data in real time. Let's open the same product as we previously opened. Okay, so here, here are all the elements. We were looking into it. Here's the compare button. Here's the wishlist button. The add to cart widget have the quantity and the add to cart button. Here are some features. 
or this is a short code HTML block ID 1101 so this is a custom short code you can modify that by going to the admin the payment methods uh, these are just the image gallery so you can add images These are the custom specifications as my website is not related to the computers so I have to remove this these are for mobiles or PC we can remove this from here just click here or just remove the whole column from here or there Similarly, this is the description, product content or product description, customer reviews, this is the whole element which is reviews and the review form. So people can comment and give their rating to the product. So this is how you can customize or optimize the page, a single product page in a Foodmart team. Generally, it was like this and uh, finally let's see the builder option so we are editing the product and this product showed up on edit page but uh, we were trying to edit this product so if you go to theme settings and in theme settings open single product and scroll down to the bottom and choose in builder the type the product name which you want to show as a preview so it was 8 bit dough And save the option now if you try to open the editor for the single product just reload because we do not want to save the changes to existing template if you reload then the preview of uh, this product will be directed to the product we were initially opened and we select it in the settings now so uh, you can see we have opened this product and in the editor you can also see the products as example so this is how you can customize or modify the single product page in woodmark theme i hope you learned something from today's video please give the video a like and please subscribe my channel uh, so you won't miss my future videos thank you